Hello, so welcome back. Thanks guys for coming back. And I wanted to finish saying my part two about my bubble gun journey and all the bubble guns to purchase. And as you can see here, this is the bubble gun that I was last talking about in my previous video. You can go check out part one. And I added a little strap. And that's the thing I was talking about. It's very convenient when you have the strap because you don't have to worry about holding it and carrying it. But here I was here in um, Cancun, Mexico. And it was definitely a vibe there um, to be outside, be by the pool and the water. The bubbles are definitely um, a really good... Um, thing to bring that definitely adds to like the atmosphere of be being magical and being outside so let's continue and we finished up this bubble gun oh i will say that i ended up purchasing it twice so i've had it twice and i'll say that it was pretty good um and the only issue i had was definitely that um the little uh prong holes kind of got wrapped around inside there but overall five stars okay let's go to the next one. Oh, and before i go to the next one um i did say that um the only reason why i ended up getting a different kind from this one is because i was going to an event that i really really wanted to bring a bubble gun and i was a little bit nervous um and hesitant to just automatically go and show up with the bubble gun because i have been to certain venues sometimes where the owner or the managers or the host or whomever so i think it was like the owner at the time they kind of was giving the bubbles like a side eye and so you know to be fair and respectful I chose that I decided I wanted to like you know just ask in advance to go can I bring a bubble gun and they sent me an email back and the email um, basically said they'd go check on it and then they said yes you can definitely bring your bubble gun and just make sure that it's a small you can bring a small bubble gun that was what they said and so after that I was like "Ooh, this one might not work and I didn't want to get turned away, especially because there was a ticketed event. So I definitely had to kind of do a little bit more research and dive a little deeper and see if I could find a bubble gun that was a little bit smaller and had all the things that I need. So, okay, let's continue. Next. Okay, here we go. Cool. So this is the one that I got. Because I wanted. This is the one that I purchased because I wanted to get something that was smaller. So I wasn't really sure if it was going to be smaller. So I had to get it and see in advance. And I really enjoyed this one, okay? This one comes with uh, two two of the bubble guns. And it comes with each with their own battery, rechargeable batteries, and bubble solutions. I'm not sure if it came with an extra set. I feel like I might have misplaced one. But that's neither here nor there. Um, they actually hold a good amount of bubble solution. And so far, they haven't leaked on me. And I've had them probably for about two months, I'd say. And I... Yes, so I got these and they um they're about twenty they right here it says they're on sale for about twenty four twenty and I think that's pretty affordable. Um I'd say I'd give it about maybe four and a half out of five. Um just just cause, you know. Um I don't have anything bad to say. So hmm, maybe maybe we'll up it up. We'll just say four point eight out of five. Um, I wish they had like a little, you know, just a little strap, but that's just me. Okay, moving on. And as you see, it says it has 42 holes, plenty bubbles with lights, and it does come, it does light up. And the lights aren't too um, obnoxious. It's it's fine. Good, good, good amount of lighting for uh, this bubble gun. And it is very durable and sturdy and definitely gives you with the bubble solution. You may have to go out at some point and buy your own because you'll need more bubble solution if you really want to have a good time. And look, we have all the bubbles with all the photos with all the kids and the marriages. It's beautiful for the weddings and the outside and summertime. So, you know, it's definitely a good buy. Look at all the bubbles. Okay, now we have stepped into the big guns. We've evolved, okay? This is not a bubble gun. This is actually a bubble machine. And this one I purchased for a birthday party, among other things to definitely just have for an outside event. But this definitely, the party um, definitely motivated me to up my bubble game up, to say the least. I was going to a kid's birthday party. And so I ended up getting this bubble machine. And it says it's a three LED lights remote control. It comes with a remote control. 
comes with a remote control. So it's indoor and outdoor fun. It comes with an LED screen operation, adjustable speed, powered by plug-in or battery. Plug-in or battery. Do you hear do you hear what I just said? So now it's definitely a hundred percent portable and stationary. When I when I purchased this, this was about $22. And I ended up returning it because look at that sale price. Y'all not gonna get me. Y'all not gonna get me twice. So it's on sale for $16.99. Okay? Okay. And I will say the light is definitely five stars. Ten out of ten. Because at nighttime, when you just have it outside. You can kind of, it has a different kind of like flashlighting modes and stuff. So you can, you know, people that might suffer from seizures and things like that might have to be mindful of like the flashing lights, but there are um, different kinds of modes for the lighting that can definitely, um, it's a complete vibe. And you see here, let me see, maybe it'll explain it. I can show, but you see like in the front part of this machine, that's where you put the bubble solution. So you, and it has handles. Can we give it, get, have a moment? To just say thank you <sighs> thank you thank you thank you for the handle i'll take it ah yes here see look so it gives you all the dimensions it's a little bulky but it's not huge um it has the lights the led screen panel so it does have like a little screen panel on top that it can give you the information of what's going on there it does have a charging power jack and it comes with a battery case for your rechargeable batteries. Now you will have to get, um, you will have to get rechargeable batteries. I believe rechargeable double A batteries for the battery pack. But once you recharge those, set it, and it's great. It's good to go. And then the remote control takes AAA batteries. But again, remote control, like I can definitely command and order the bubbles from across the room. Like, stop. Like. <laughs> What more do you need for outside fun? Like, get you one of these, please. Please, please, please. Totally worth it, okay? And see, there's the batteries. Those are the ones that you need to get. And those are probably about, like, anywhere from, like, $10 to $15 for the rechargeable batteries, which is a pretty good price. And they last a pretty good time, pretty long time. I didn't have to recharge the batteries when I used them. Um, and I believe I had it going on and off throughout the day for about maybe, like, four or five hours so it's pretty good and of course look at all the bubbles at the wedding looks like total fun with the confetti and everything so that's definitely the vibes that this bubble machine is giving so five out of five okay we're coming down to the wire this is last but not least or the last last or the end end but it will be the last for this video <laughs> these bubble guns um I don't know what they're going to be like because I actually just got them because I'm going to need some bubble guns that were I needed some bubble guns that were smaller and easily portable something that I can almost carry on my person like on my body and so I was looking for something that had like a little space and as you can see as you can see from this photo I have you can put your hand through it it's for the you know it's for the kids but I needed a space for the strap so that I can strap it on me. Like, <laughs> so these do come with um, a screwdriver, but it's also just for regular battery operated um, use. So AA batteries is what's what it's going to take. But that is quite all right because I'm definitely going to be traveling with them. So it's fine either way. I just really needed something that just fit. Um, so we're going to have to test this theory out soon. But look at it. It's so cute. And I think it's going to work. It's going to give me what I need. Um, and the only issue, though, that I had is that, look, it says at the bottom, it could not be shipped to my selected delivery location. So I had to choose another one. So I had to ship to my friend's house. And thanks, girl. I love you. And um, she mailed it to me. Um, so, wow, they don't ship to New York City. I guess, whatever. But <laughs> it's not going to stop this show. So that is all that I have for you today. Um, those are all the lists of the bubble guns that I've experienced and went through. The pros, the cons, the good, the bad, the ugly, the messy. And it's all fun. And I'm so grateful to be able to spend this time sharing you guys about my bubble gun journey. Ah, oh, here's a picture of that other bubble gun when I was out there in the Six Flags. So thanks for watching and come again soon. Talk to you later. Love you. Bye.